beach volleyball, one of the most popular sports at the Olympics and also a glamorous venue. How does that feel? It feels amazing. Obviously, when the um, venue was announced quite a long time ago now, um, we were kind of surprised and pleasantly surprised with the venue that we got. So, um, yeah, well, since then, we've obviously gotten used to the idea that we are going to be playing in central London, an amazing location. So um, now we've been announced as a team. So it's really exciting times. And of course the kit today, how exciting is it to actually try the kit on? Oh amazing, it just kind of like, it's a finishing touch on an amazing day and like an amazing kind of announcement of what we're, what we're going to be doing and we are the team. So yeah, it's just, it just gives you tingles to actually have like the flag on you and to kind of have like the official kit. So yeah, it just makes you feel like part of the team and ready to go. A lot of tension on the kit obviously in your sport and there's obviously a lot of focus on is it sex symbol or sports star, where do you fall in that debate? Obviously, I think it's the best thing that we can um, we can play in. Um, I wouldn't want to be on the sand or anything else. It's it's definitely not um, a requirement on a sexy part at all. It's just kind of what we do, how we perform, and we play in really really hot temperatures. We play in Thailand and it's plus 50 degrees. Um, I wouldn't want to be on the sand or anything else. So it's perfect for our sport. Last year you had an interesting kit. You got sponsored by Betfair and you had to wear a barcode. What was yeah. that like? <laughs> Yeah, obviously, I, when I was playing, I wasn't thinking about the barcode <laughs> on our bikinis. Um, but obviously, we are professional athletes, and kind of a way for us to make money is through endorsements. So um, we were approached by a company, and we kind of saw it as a big, good business deal. So that was how it all started. <laughs> I guess the glamour of the sport is a way of getting people hooked in, but obviously your job now is to get people hooked, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. We kind of want people to come along and see beach volleyball and see kind of how athletic you have to be to play the sport and how exciting it can be and how spectacular it can be so um, yeah obviously if we want people to come with an open mind and just see if they enjoy the sport. Countries like Germany and America and other places in Brazil I think it's very very seriously taken sport isn't it? Do you think we'll ever get to that position in Great Britain? I think we will I think um, obviously in those countries you just mentioned they've had tours been established for a long time they've got a whole history of beach volleyball in their countries we don't have that and that's one one step these games are going to help us move towards is building a history and building a legacy for beach volleyball obviously the more international events we can have the more we can showcase showcase what we can do and what other international teams can do and um, it won't I mean once those events happen it really won't be very long until the nation is captivated. <laughs> Obviously working together as a team it's very important to uh, to have that partnership. How long has it been going? Um, we've been playing together now for about five years. We did have a little mini break but we got back together. <laughs> um, so yeah quite a long time. It's really hard work obviously um, when on days like this it's amazing and it's so nice to be able to share it with somebody but obviously there are times when things get tough and things but when we have to really work together and stick together so um, but it's amazing to be honest to have somebody to share it with kind of a sister relationship then? It is, I think uh, we, we describe it more as a marriage because um, we kind of have to, we do, we kind of go through the ups and downs together and kind of have to make sure that even when we don't want to talk to each other we have to because the team is, is ultimately the most important thing. The best thing is, is we get on outside of outside of the court and, and that makes it a lot easier that when it gets tough we kind of think okay you know like <laughs> she's, a nice she's a nice person, I really like her like um, which just adds to the partnership and adds to our dynamics so yeah it's, it's definitely something that I don't think many sports people get to experience is just kind of the type of partnership and the kind of t type of relationship that we have which is just so special. And how big a motivation is it to inspire the next generation of beach volleyball girls? Yeah it's, it's really important I mean volleyball's given us so much and beach volleyball's given us so much like so many amazing experiences so much we've learned so much about ourselves about each other about working in a team so um, I just hope that other kind of youths um, get to experience what we have. Excellent good look thank you. Thanks. Thanks.